a very good day to everyone so today I'll be reviewing um, this book it's called the invisible smile by Grant Morrison and this is a beast of a book uh, I mean calling this book huge would be an understatement in itself to give you a point of reference how big this book is like um, all five of my fingers fit from cover to cover so it's that thick and my hands are pretty largish I would say so yeah if you have read any work by Grant Morrison you probably know that um, he uh, deals in books in storylines that are very unusual I mean the plots pan out very differently from what most other uh, <coughs> people would say and uh, Invisibles is definitely in my opinion one of the best he has ever worked on in fact when he was asked where he got the inspiration for Invisibles he said that he was abducted by aliens in Kathmandu and they gave him the idea so this is as radical a storyline as it can be it's about a group of people called the Invisibles who uh, are trying to prevent the world from being destroyed from in, uh, by intergalactic uh, people from other dimensions interdimensional I guess yeah interdimensional uh, beings alien beings that have already invaded our world and have um, and and work by ways that have been uh, already predicted by conspiracy theorists I mean this is radical the storyline is radical there is there is a boy uh, who is a drug addict who is the future Buddha Maitreya Maitreyi I think yeah Maitreyi the one of the guys this guy to be more specific he is the leader king mob and he 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 is uh, modeled on Gandhi and he is the most violent of, of, of them all then there is a uh, um, a sorceress a gay sorcerer yeah sorceress I guess uh, a girl from the future uh, an African um, girl who is uh, who is uh, versed in Kung Fu and Tai Jitsu I mean the storyline is <coughs> out of the world now coming on to the actual book okay it's the the artwork is very nice but it's not for everyone it's heavily uh, geared towards adult themes and there are lots of uh, points which are not meant for children this is certainly not a children's book if you are looking for one and um, the thing is very complex to say the least the storyline is extremely complex I mean wrapping your head around the whole storyline can be difficult if this is your first Morrison book uh, so yeah but it's it's definitely a very fun read there are like um, African mambo users and uh, mambo jumbo and it has almost anything that you can possibly think of in terms of mysticism and uh, science fiction from time machine to almost anything yeah so and there are full page <coughs> artworks which are from the individual uh, volumes and it all ends with a uh, with a few yeah into the super context behind the invisible curtain so yeah it has <coughs> extra artwork by the author and the illustrators so like it includes some extra stuff as well if you want those which is I, I don't think it's available in the single TPBs and they are very nicely done I mean the whole thing brings out the context of invisibles as it was originally portrayed and there's a storyboarding as well so yeah <coughs> That's the Invisible Somnibus for you. It's called the Invisible Smile. And 
Australia. There you go. If you like this video, uh, give it a like, comment if you want. If you have any questions, feel free to ask them of me. And uh, that's it. Happy reading, everyone.